goal from Neil Madsen on the inside. He gets there, but once again, the run from the outside, Lambert coming through. Tight there with Mickelson. Tight down the back straight, but Lambert slams the door shut going into turn number three. Expect a little bit of an advantage from there, but uh, as they leave the start, you can see he doesn't make a bad start. He hits the front, but uh, it's that run from gate four for Robert Lambert as he just moves across, clashes there with Mickelson. And then, as I said, bravely, bravely puts his front wheel over the uh, sloping curve down on the inside to stop that run. Four. Take all oh, Cabrera just had a little bit of a twitch there on the start line. Great start from Wozniak, but here comes Bewley roaring round the outside. That's poetry in motion from Bewley. He loved that. Got his back wheel in the dirt and the bike powered himself to the front. We've now got Cabrera and Wozniak fighting for second place. And guess what? Freddie Lingwin, he's out the back. Front though, and a good battle for second. Uh, when Dan Bewley is flowing on the bike, there's no one better to watch. But I tell you what, he's coming under a lot of pressure from Simon Wozniak. He would do nothing better than to, to, to take the lead in this race in front of these Polish crowd. He looks like he might do it here. What a ride. Wozniak hits the front. Bewley chops back to the end. Repays the compliment. We've got less than a lap to go. Simon Wozniak riding out of his skin here. He has ridden a stormering in his opening ride. Heat number four. Simon Wozniak out of gate number three. Stunning opening ride from him. Ball's moving all over the place. Missed the start big time. Now has got there. Look at the but Look at Doyle. Doyle's oh, come from nowhere. How on earth has he done that? Freddie Lingwood now up the inside. Speedway in heat number 11, Doyle back to the front. What an opening lap of Speedway in that. It doesn't get better. I tell you what, Jason Doyle almost did himself a favour by moving there because he gave himself a lot of room to make the cutback. His body weight's all in the wrong place, makes an absolutely terrible start. He does receive a warning for that movement at the start, but it just allows him the room to make the cutback up the inside very successfully. And then, of course, he goes into a battle with Freddie Lindgren. Two of the old guys in this lineup, but look at them going at each other. Riding like teenagers. Doyle's beaten for the first time this evening. He's still on eight points, so almost certainly through to the semi finals. Freddie Lingwin, a superb effort from him. They swap places several. Side gate. Indeed, he has. He's had a win in the second and the last. Wow. That is some star from Wozniak. Absolutely flew out of the gate. Textbook stuff from him. Through in the second place is Jason Doyle. Leon Madsen's on the outside with Shiniak. Look at Doyle. Doyle coming up the inside. Can he hit the front? Yes, he can momentarily. Wozniak and Doyle neck and neck for first place. What a corner oh. from Doyle. The Australian riding out of his skin there. He's having to come from the back. That wasn't a good start. Wozniak really roaring off the start line there in red. And you can see how hard Jason Doyle's working. The bike just grabbing a load of traction halfway around the first turn. And uh, Wozniak looks like at this point he's got it sort of sewn up really, but he moves across the corner, leaves a big hole for Jason Doyle up the inside. And Wozniak almost conceding as they come into the corner here to turn one on the second lap. And he, I think he realises that when Jason Doyle's up the inside of you, he's going to keep coming. You've got to get out of the way. Yeah. And he does so, stays on the bike, gives chase. Another good ride from him, though. On, tapes up. Wolfram has made a great reaction. We're going to the first corner. He's in no man's land. He's gone. Oh, he's gone to the back. Can you believe that? Out in front, oh, though. Come here. Here we go. Round the outside, Dominic Cabrera hits the front. My goodness gracious me, where did Martin Baxley come from? He steams up the inside. It's all going on Quebec. here. Oh, what Jan a Quebec. racing. Jan Quebec once again hits the front. And Wolfenden to the back. You can't take your eyes off of this one. Yeah, Wolfenden now looking for a way up the inside on Cabrera. Cabrera wow. led this race, and now he's finding himself in third place. Yeah, you called it here, Kelvin. Ty Wolfenden made a great start from the inside gate, and then he goes around the middle of the track. He's not in the dirt, he's taking a wide line, he's got no traction, and uh, just has riders up the inside of him. At this point, look, Jan Kovec, the uh, rider in blue there, hits the front, then Kubera says, OK, I'll have some of that up the inside. Moves Kovec over, and of course, Martin Vashelik. He's come off gate three, he's only had one race winner all night, takes full advantage of the whole left. Look at the mistake there from Jan Kovec as Kubera comes up the inside of him. It's all getting a little bit untidy for him there. Done well to stay on the bike, actually. Indeed he did, but uh, at the con uh, conclusion, it's Martin Vasilik that comes through in flying colours. Desperately disappointing for Ty Wolfenden after such a good reaction away from the tapes. 
found himself in an awkward spot in the first corner. 